Mr. Howard, Joey Abel, after fantastic win and a fantastic performance. Yeah. If you guys don't watch Joey Abel, start watching exciting boxing. Tell me how the fight went inside of the ring. I felt like it was, he, was a t he was a tough tough cookie. I caught him a couple of times. He just kept coming forward, threw me off. I didn't think I was catching him as quite as hard as I thought it was. So I had to slow my roll down a little bit um, just, to, just to make sure that I was able to go 12 full hard rounds. Um, it was good. I was catching him. He caught me a couple times. I just knew that when I was catching him, he was slowing down progressively. So it was just a matter of time before I caught, him. caught the punch, caught the chin. When we were preparing for him, uh, and then you saw him inside of the ring, you were actually fighting him. The preparation was on the spot, exactly what you guys expect, or was he a little bit tougher? Why I'm asking, because he caught a couple of your bombs, and I was like saying, man, this guy is still there. I have to give him the props for that. Yeah, yeah I didn't think he was going to take a couple of the shots that he took, and I, and I really didn't think that he was going to be coming forward at all in the first um, five rounds. I thought he was just going to be running, mm -hmm. waiting, waiting. Supposedly, it was a... It was a tactic, but it didn't really help Yeah, me. well, it helped me. You know, I'm glad I'm, he was running <laughs> right into my punches, so I mean, it helped me. And, uh, and as far as me getting tired, I, I suppose with his constant pressure, I, was, you know, it was, uh, I wasn't tired, but it, uh, after, you know, I figured after about another six, seven rounds, it might be start wearing on me. So it, was, it threw me off a, a touch, but not, not, nothing made a difference. Three fights, three KOs, last three fights. Uh, how do you see the future for you right now? I mean, spectacular wins. I mean, in Poland versus the guy who, according to Boxwag, is theoretically 30 uh, places better than you are. Obviously, it wasn't the case. I mean, what are the plans? You're going to leave it to Tony or, or you want to have an input to what's happened next? No, I, you know, I, I take any input. Um, I leave it up to Tony. He's the promoter. Um, I, I have a lot of, you know, I learned, I figured out some things that I still need to work on. You know, I've been learning every fight since I started and, um, you know, the, and I'm still, and I'm still learning. There's things that I want to do, do different that to make me top, you know, to be able to contend with the top 10 guys, you know, I'm not, my boxing skill probably needs to be stepped up just a little bit. Just, just t touch up a little bit of everything I already have and I should be good. Thank you very much, Joe Abel. Congratulations again. Thank you.